Good morning, everyone. I just woke up, so forgive me with my morning face with glasses. Um, every morning I woke up, I will write down my dreams. Um, and these days I'm recording uh, my process of uh, trans channeling um, process. So every morning when I woke up, I would do kind of connect with my uh, ascended masters, my guides. And, uh, but I was sitting on my couch and I was like, mm, let me tune in to check what are the things that uh, um, I'm working on or I need to work on to open my channel more. And uh, when I pick up the message, you know, uh, and I, I feel like that's something I want to share with you guys too. Uh, it is my first time when I do something practice to make it to share with the world and when I actually don't know where it takes me. Uh, it's kind of a little bit not the way I usually do. I usually, you know, when, right? Everybody shares things when they feel like they know what they're doing when they share. Um, this is not my style. But with this process in the last, uh, you know, over a week or so, uh, I feel called any time I tune into something shows up in my energy field. And I have this uh, feeling is this is not only, uh, I'm not the only one who are experiencing this. So they wanted me to make, actually share boldly and um, with the world. <laughs> and I think that's the, sometime we need to, we grow with each other, we learn with each other. So hope uh, those uh, trans channel um, practice uh, could also help you too, because I literally don't know uh, what, what, where are they gonna, what, what are they gonna talk about? But since I already tap in a little bit, um, I already connect with them. Uh, we're going to talk a little bit about anger, uh, self-judgment, uh, self-rejection, and, and abandonment, um, and the pain in the heart. And I will uh, talk a little bit more when we tap into that. But I got the sensation of in my body for like 3 to 10 seconds, then realized I'm going to come out to start recording this video. So here we are. We're going to go in again. Uh, if you're interested to uh, trans channeling, uh, the differences between trans channeling and the conscious channeling, I just made a two videos that I did a demo um, of because I've been doing conscious channeling for uh, last four years and uh, just stepping into the trans channeling, but everything is built up and I just think it's fun to uh, show showcase uh, what it feels like to do the conscious channeling and what it feels like to do trans channeling. Okay, so you can find it in the <clears throat> playlist of trans channeling. Good morning, we are Saint Germain. We are happy to be here to talk to you again uh, in your human time. Uh, this channel literally just woke up and uh, doing her normal uh, morning routine to connect with uh, her own energy, connect with her guides. Um, we gonna we actually uh, invited her or we actually pushed her a little bit <laughs> to uh, share those uh, process uh, with the world because we know, we understand that there are so many of you out there are curious about uh, what's going on with your own transformation. There are certain things in your energy field that you just bring to the attention that you want to have more answers, more questions. And it will be perfect time for this channel to share those messages because it's very raw, it's very, uh, very, and she she doesn't really use this word authentic. Uh, it more feels like you know, uh, uh, in a way to show what's going on. But we're gonna use the word uh, use the word authentic because it's it's something that um she won't be have too much of control over what she's saying because she's in a chance channel state, chance net chance channel state. And uh, so many of you have question about the chance channeling. It's more of like when people when she's in the trans channeling, almost feel like she's not in control of what she's saying. However, we also can acknowledge what she's thinking so we can actually blend uh, 
uh, the message to acknowledge what she's feeling and uh, uh, bring the message through uh, with her feeling to uh, to deep explain uh, what the message would be, if that makes sense. That's what she usually say, if that makes sense. Um, so today we're gonna actually I'm gonna talk about uh, a lot of the um, hmm. We're gonna start with solar plexus first, okay? Solar plexus here uh, is sells a lot of when people have a lot of trust issue, have a fear. Uh, is usually will be in this center. Now we're also gonna talk about this uh, financial. Uh, a fear of a financial instability, uh, instability in the financial uh, gain. And a lot of you empath or people, uh, uh, especially empath, um, you will have a hard time actually manifest uh, uh, financial and uh, uh, just earthling things in your life. And uh, uh, including this channel, she's been doing a lot of inner work. She's been doing a lot of world work in the world and sometimes she just don't understand what's what's going on why 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 and we are actually working with her these days to help to understand is what kind of box she's in or uh she born into the, the dynamic uh through her ancestors through mostly her ancestor and uh, we are helping her to understand where these limiting beliefs come from so she can transmute with uh different healing tools but uh, just knowing that uh, you carry certain limiting belief is is great to start to examine yourself, to look into yourself, how you uh, usually spend money, how you treat money, uh, uh, how you feel when you uh, ask to uh, pay for a meal or things like that. But we are deeply want to talk about that self abandonment, self rejection, and uh, when the channel tapping too, she says, "What do you mean self?" rejection i love myself i welcome myself how would i i reject myself and we showed her some example of how she rejected herself uh even when she makes the makes those videos you know we, we're talking about willpower confidence here again that actually she made the video uh the day um and she felt called to share and then uh, however because she afraid of people gonna judge it, um, her whether it's a true story a true true message or she's making up uh, those, those those messages and so she kind of like because she don't trust herself so she rejected herself she rejected this part of herself that is so excited to share this story but the other side of her that uh, carries the wound of uh, this trust uh, and also how people receive her in the past. So she literally rejected that passionate version of her and taking over and uh, also procrastinated uh, even uh, leave the video alone for a couple of days. And uh, later, because we are working with her these days and uh, uh, we basically, actually, we literally kind of pushed her a little bit or we inspire her, we, we uh, invited her to uh, post these videos with you guys. So do you see uh, did she see um did you see that those are also sometimes you are reject yourself because you don't think you are good enough you are reject your uh your own parts of you that you don't feel good enough your ego comes show show up online so those are only the small examples that we can uh use this channel to talk to uh to explain and we also want to talk about self abandonment. Self abandonment issue, it, it, it kind of very similar to this, to this energy we are talking about here. Uh, you reject yourself. You self abandon yourself. You abandon this uh, one part of yourself because you don't feel worthy. You don't feel confident. You feel you don't feel kind of like solid, solid enough. And then not only this channel, uh, there are so many channels out there. Uh, you feel that way too. Uh, so we want to talk about that a little bit more. And also, uh, that's uh, just give us a minute. Uh, need to drink a lot of water when I do those things. Uh. Okay. Uh. Okay. So another aspect is uh, we'll talk about the anger. Anger and rage, uh, the anger towards yourself and the anger uh, and the other people, uh, anger towards you. 
and not many people know how to release anger in a positive way. We always treat anger as a bad thing. And uh, a lot of time, even for people, it seems very peaceful, very calm, but they are actually holding on a lot of anger, which is not serving them. And uh, um, in manifestation, we are talking about manifestation. In manifestation, your own self-judgment and uh, uh, the hidden uh, the anger and the rage is it, going to be the blocks. We so-called blocks is actually... Uh, you know, nobody's block you. You are block your own self. Your uh, your emotions. You not allow yourself to go through your physical body because you're judging yourself. Uh, because when you judge yourself, you don't like that part of yourself. You abandon that the part of self you don't think is good. You reject that part of yourself. It's like don't think about that way. Don't think about that way. But when you say you don't think about that way, you are, you are actually always think about that thing. So we want to bring up those emotions uh, up here to uh, allow you to aware of those uh, kind of feeling and then just just sit with that a little bit and also ask our support to ask Saint Germain and the, and his team and our team to uh, help you to transmute the fear back to love and when you ask us support you don't really need to do much you just simply uh, uh, we simply have a permission you know to come to work with you uh, you just simply need to ask when you ask you shall receive and you don't need to worry about how this is going to happen uh when it's going to happen uh, when it's going to be done uh this is not your on your own timing uh universe has its perfect timing uh, this channel ask us to uh, uh consciously invite us in uh a week ago and uh, in the last uh, seven eight days she has been experiencing a lot of physical um symptoms even as uh things like uh, she always gets very thirsty and uh, uh because she doesn't like really like drinking water before and uh when you don't really like drinking water we're gonna make her drink water we are we are actually making fun of her right here <laughs> she's making fun of us and making she's making fun of herself so we want to uh this is the message for today and uh we kind of deeply want you to sit with this message to ask yourself in which area in your life you judge yourself, you criticize yourself, you reject yourself, you abandon yourself, you don't really trust yourself, you think things are out of control, you have carried this fear. Um, we thank you so much. Uh, we love you and take care. Okay, guys. This is the message for today. Actually, today, uh, this is also... Oh, this will be also be my homework uh, to ask myself. I like the journaling. So I'm going to journal about that. Um, and I'm going to keep allow uh, the healing work and open my channel. Uh, when every time I come out of uh, the stage, actually, my the way I speak, I can follow up kind of like a little bit. I'm still in it. I have to disconnect it. Uh, but I just want to finish this video. And... Uh, um, if you have any questions, feel free to reach out, feel free to share, comment, and if any questions you want me channel, I will do that too. Um, talk to you guys soon.